Hello Buccaneers, this is our Southern California day trip to Carpinteria and we are going to show you the fun things you can do here. Nestled in the Santa Ynez Mountains, tiny Carpinteria is among SoCal's charming seaside town. And our first stop is Carpinteria State Beach. This place offers a mile of beach for swimming, surf fishing, tide pool exploring, and camping. Now we're doing the Junior Ranger program. Once we complete this activity book, we will turn it in to receive a badge. The Spanish named the area Carpinteria, meaning carpentry shop, because the Shumas tribe that lived here had a large seagoing canoe building enterprise. We're taking a little walk to the Tomo Interpretive Play Area. Brother, be careful climbing the hut. I'm riding a dolphin. I'm going down a bumpy slide. Now we're having lunch at the Worker Bee Cafe. This is a cozy American daytime cafe for omelets, sandwiches, and old school shakes, plus a pet friendly patio. There's even a fun kids menu. The best part is that this restaurant offers an intimate family feel where everyone knows each other. I'm eating chicken fried steak with house fries and biscuit with gravy and brothers having chocolate chip pancakes and cake It's very yummy. <laughs> my mom ordered a pumpkin waffle, which was the special of the day, while my dad got some French toast. The chicken fried steak is really saucy. I like the gravy. And the meat itself is really juicy. French toast has vanilla and cinnamon on it. It's good. And the house fries. The house fries, I love the seasoning. Now I'm going to try my mom's pumpkin waffle. I've never had one before. So it's really unique and perfect for the season. Waffle that tastes like pumpkin. The pancake is very chocolatey, which means it is good. <laughs> I am so full, I can't eat another bite. Brother gives this meal his signature thumbs up. Our next stop is the Carpinteria Bluffs Nature Preserve. This place offers a glimpse of the region's natural wonders. Don't jam your toes, brother. It's time to cross the railroad. Remember to watch out for trains. Choo choo! We found a plant that's like a dandelion. Whoa! <laughs> now we're hiking down to the beach. Why is there a stop sign in the middle of the beach? This is why there's a stop sign. Ready? I am going to run. Look, I found some seashells. There is some interesting sea life in the tide pool. We had a fun time exploring here. Our next stop is the Carpinteria Valley Museum of History. Whee! This place provides a fascinating glimpse into the valley's past. The docent is showing us some toys that the kids used to play a long time ago. <laughs> ah, creepy dolls! Next, we're learning about the Shumash Indians. The docent is showing us how they live, and Brother is picking up a piece of talk. We also looked at exhibits of World War I, a giant quilt, and a miniature house. Brother is playing with some hands-on exhibits. We also got to see an old living room, kitchen, and schoolhouse. More creepy dolls. Let's head to the next location. Now we are at Tarp 
Pitts Park. <laughs> no music! <laughs> this beachfront site features a series of rare natural asphalt lakes plus trails with ocean views. Turn in our Junior Ranger booklets to receive our bath. Our next stop is the Carpinteria Salt Marsh Nature Park. Restored in the late 90s, this 15-acre park is one of the last and healthiest coastal wetlands along the SoCal coast. More than 200 bird species have been documented in this teeming estuary. We had a great time bird watching here. Our next stop is Chocolates du Cali Resto. The chocolates here have earned many worldwide accolades in magazines, brochures, and traveling guides. We received samples of the bassoos, but I didn't want it because it has orange flavor. But brothers seem to enjoy the piece of candy. Lastly, we're having dinner at Cadero Beach Grill. This place offers great food, spectacular views, friendly service, and a family-style atmosphere. Let's take a glimpse of the sun before it sets. I'm having a pretzel burger. The, the bun is made of pretzel. And sweet, there's sweet potato fries. And brother's eating croutons. <laughs> no, brother's eating chicken tenders. My mom ordered the barbecue chicken salad and my dad got some fish tacos. So my burger has barbecue sauce in it. It tastes great. And I like, I, the idea of having the bun as pretzel is really unique. I give this a double thumbs up. And also, I like the fire behind us. That's great. And I feel the ocean. Brother, how are the chicken tenders? The outside is very crunchy and the chicken is very juicy. Double thumb. I really like the setting because you can see the beach and all the lights on top and it really feels like you're in Hawaii. We had a fun day in Carpinteria. Please hit the subscribe button and remember to look for your own adventure.